Uh, no, it was exciting, uh, you know, just been preparing. I've been playing a lot of center, both interior, so, you know, it's been fun just learning both positions. So I was grateful that I got the opportunity to go in there. It was great. Uh, all the guys were very supportive with me. You know, like Savion McCade, Rame, Walter, all the guys, like Jake Taylor, Jacob Sexton, all the guys on the side were real supportive, keeping me up, keeping me positive. The whole group, that was the biggest thing on Saturdays. We all kept each other up. You mentioned learning both positions. How fun has that been? Has it been a lot? Has it been you know, hard, easy? What's that been like? Oh, it's definitely, you know, nothing's easy in life, but it's definitely been, I've enjoyed it. Cause you know, you get to learn, you get to make yourself a little bit more valuable. Plus you learn one position, you learn all five. So any way I can help the team is my mindset for it. Did you sort of know that was a possibility when you made the choice to transfer? Uh, yes and no, I kind of figured, but it was like, you know, just be ready for whatever happens. Any opportunity I can take, I just wanted to be the best at what I can do. Does that help you build chemistry with Andrew, knowing that you guys are talking about the offense playing center and then when you slide it next to him? Oh yeah, absolutely. Me and Raym have gotten pretty close, so we'll talk all the time. He'll help me, me and him. We'll sit on the sideline before and be like, hey, right here, what do, you, what do I need to do a little bit better for you to help you out right here? Same, vice versa, it's just, the more we communicate, the better, because the better, the more we're on the same page, the better for everything. What's it like during an in-game change? How does Coach Beatonville tell you guys he's making a change in-game? Uh, <laughs> pretty much it's just, we're going right here, and then you just kind of go with it. I think I think y'all know how Coach B is. <laughs> what are you telling yourself when you get the call? Just trust your coaching, trust your footwork, trust the guys around you. Because if I trust, I trust all five guys, from myself to all the guys around me. I know that if I do my job, they're going to do their job, and I know Coach B has put me in the best possible situation to be the best on the field. Now you've had a couple days, how did you kind of assess how you did in there? Oh, definitely, definitely got a lot to work on. Definitely got a lot to work on. Not, not, you know, I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, it was terrible or oh, it was great. But, you know, definitely, oh, and, you know, that goes for everybody. Everybody's got stuff they need to work on. But, yeah, definitely, definitely got to get better every day. 1% better every day. Uh, just get, I think, get more comfortable in the position. But, I mean, I think that will come over time. It's still it's still early for me, so we'll see how it goes. But I think I think as the game progressed, it got better for me. When you look at the offensive line as a whole, what do you guys need to do to be more consistent in the running game? In the running game, I think I mean, in all honesty, you know, we still had a hundred yard rusher, which is still hard in college football. So you know, it's pretty good. But definitely, I think we need to be a little bit more consistent. I think it just needs to come all all five of us, all six, all twenty, however many it is, from scout team, all those guys. We just I think it really comes down to everybody being together. Because the more you are all together, there's not like one going back and forth. I'm not saying that happens or anything, but the more you're all together, you feel more comfortable and you feel like you're about to get the best out of what you've put into it. A couple game days under your belt, how much more comfortable do you feel today than maybe even you know a couple weeks ago? Oh, I feel a lot more comfortable. And that's what, uh, especially like me and my dad, I've been joking around with him. And I just told him, I said, just give it a couple more weeks. I said, but everything will start coming to me more and more. But it's definitely, it's helped a lot. And like, like I said, getting with some of the guys, talking with them, it's helped a lot, like especially with Rain, McCade. I mean, I know yesterday me and McCade talked and he was just telling me like guard steps. And I go talk to Rain about center steps. Just kind of stuff like that. Just, you know, everybody wants the best for one another. Is it easier to lock in when there are in-game subs? Because you know your number might be called at a moment's notice. <laughs> I think my mindset's always been just stay ready so you don't got to get ready. So, you know, I always know, you never know, next man up mentality. You never know what's going to happen. The game is full of surprises, so you don't know what's going to happen. Thankfully, no one's injured, so you stay healthy, but you always got to be ready for your number. And that goes from if you're a first-year guy that just got here to a transfer to a six-year guy. Everyone's got to be ready for their opportunity. You mentioned when you play center, but there would have been that you played more of kind of like in your career back in high school or that you uh, previous school I played center of the majority, but I played some guards, so it's kind of been a mix of both. I think, like, game game rep-wise, I've played more center than guard, but at the end of the day, it's all the same thing. You just got to not have a ball in your hand on one play and you do in the other. <laughs> uh, you know, just the technique stuff that I got to work on, which I knew, like, going into it, I knew that there was some technique stuff that needed to be going through, and it was, you know, him just telling me, like, better with your hands, stuff like that, you know, it's just... Stuff like that. Nothing nothing too crazy, just the the coaching here and there. <laughs>